Hey, what's up everybody? This is Like It's 1985, and today we'll be taking a look at the 6-inch scale Black Series, of course Star Wars, Black Series AT-AT or AT-AT driver action figure. So this is the one in this particular wave that I was actually looking forward to. It's, you know, it's basically kind of a grunt and in terms of just being not really uh, character specific in terms of having a unique personality. It's just the driver or the pilot of the AT-AT uh, or AT-AT uh, vehicle. So, but this is a figure that I actually had in smaller scale as a kid back in the 1980s when it was uh, under the Kinner line. Uh, so those of you who were kids back then will, uh, you know, relate to this as well. Uh, of course, I had the AT-AT -AT vehicle play, uh, play set and as well as the uh, action figure driver that went with it. So pretty cool. And uh, at least I think so anyways. So in terms of articulation, we'll take a look at that first. Got the head that can move quite a bit. Uh, it kind of is hindered by these conduits here. Uh, the conduits themselves actually are pretty uh, robust plastic, uh, but I wouldn't want to, you know, stress that too much beyond what is necessary to demonstrate the articulation. But yeah, you can have his helmet move up and down. Shoulders do hinge out to the side. Uh, there does there's not appear to be any waist swivel at all, just a uh, ab joint right there. Wow, that's quite a bend at the knee there. So that is articulation for this figure. Uh, you can see it does come with this one weapon here which is pretty nicely sculpted and does actually hold in his hand quite well. Uh, you can see his, uh, his actual index finger uh, is sculpted in order to figure in or in order to fit into that area where the trigger would be. That's good. Uh, looking at the details, lots of fantastic detail here just in how the the head is sculpted, the nice uh, uh, graphics that are applied to the helmet and various paint applications. Nice silver there in the back. Uh, again, I like that these conduits are rather firm plastic. I don't know how much, uh, how easily they would fall out of these or come out detached from these. Uh, I don't think that they're probably glued in there, but I wouldn't, you know, pull on those, pull on those very much. Uh, his, uh, this, this uh, piece of equipment here in his chest it would appear that it comes out, but it doesn't actually. Actually, it uh, feels like it's glued in, so uh, probably don't want to try to remove that. I uh, got these straps here, soft uh, plastic. So yeah, really nice. And again, for me, me in particular, I had I had this figure in the smaller scale uh, as a kid back in the '80s. So the fact that they actually released this as a six-inch scale figure in the Black Series is definitely two thumbs up for me. Anyways, uh, this has been my review of the Star Wars Black Series 6-inch scale AT-AT or AT-AT driver. Thanks for watching.